excited to be here and I think Wealth Diaries is a great idea and there's so much you can glean from all these people's brains and minds and achievements. So very, very inspirational as well as educational. A two year journey for us, so Stuart Lord and myself. It's a Q&A style book. One of the main goals we're trying to achieve is, is show people that you can overcome obstacles in different ways and everyone's, everyone's built differently. So being an entrepreneur, everyone will, will overcome those obstacles in a different way. I'm pretty sure it was difficult, but how did you select the 10 people that are featuring in the book? Um, we wanted to inspire the next generation of entrepreneurs by interviewing those that have actually done it themselves. So we've got a good cross-section of people in different industries and sectors who have actually done it, have started something from nothing and created something pretty special. It was, it was firstly an honour to be asked to do it because I was actually quite nervous about the whole experience. I'm good at doing a lot of things but I wasn't confident doing this. We disagreed on a few things but then we talked about it and it was actually an opportunity to connect. Moons were aligned and, and all the great people were there, their great energies and authentic natures came together. What was the highlight of working on this book? It brings you back from, from where you started and where you are today and, and that's what Wealth Management is, meeting good people, networking with good people. Fleshing out from from that exp you know the expedition the experience about what were the key business lessons and it was just great it was it was a great experience because it actually made you think about what what it was that drove you to get to the next level. The highlight was for me when I got the book through and my two little girls saw it. comes to those success conscious, happiness comes to those that are happy conscious. So. Firstly, you need to understand what success is to you. It's not about money, it's about the people that you have around you, it's about the journey that you take and it's about, um, I guess, giving back and having fun along the way.